So, plan part 12, plan with the big boys. So, Mary decided to, um, to get herself cleaned up. And uh, she went and got her, she decided her and Larry was talking about, you know, she was talking about going and get her a building and going to go into getting her a rehab building, you know, try to help these people get cleaned up. And he like, that's a good idea, Mary, that's an excellent idea, you know, get on out of here, man, why you got a chance, you know what I'm saying, because this is not for you. She said, you right, this is not for me. And so uh, she said, well, I got a few more days. I'm going to wait like a week before, you know, time for me to leave. And then I'm going to cut all this out, get myself cleaned up, get my hair cleaned up, and my mind and everything cleaned up. And so, hey, I'm going to do it. And if you ready, whenever you ready, Larry, to get yourself cleaned up, you're more welcome to, uh, to come to my rehab center. And best thing about it. Since it's you, only you, I will not charge you. You're going to be free. It's going to be on me because you really were there for me when I was down in the dump. You know what I'm saying? So this going to be my payback, show you my appreciation. So she went and got herself cleaned up and everything. And she went into this business, you know, went to, went to school and went into this uh, business class, how to go by doing business. She was successful in it because she was a very intelligent young lady, you know, and got all that taken care of and everything. She got a certificate, you know, for to go ahead and get her business stuff. And she found this building, you know, run down business. She got it fixed on up, made it look brand new and everything. And one day she was out at the grocery store and who but uh, Marvin, she ran up on Marvin. And she like, hi, Marvin. I haven't seen you all almost a year. What happened to you? You know what I'm saying? He said, man, what you did for me, the best thing a person ever did to me, man. It made me, I got myself together, man. I got me a, a little business going on. I said, really? He said, hell yeah, man. I'm doing real good with my little business. You know what I'm saying? And he said, I said, what kind of um, business, uh, you you got he said i went and bought me a a, a, a sports bar really tell my new where they be watching all the sports and all them pool table and he said yes ma'am and he said it's one of the number one top over there with the the, the where i live at man it is bumping you ought to come stop by and see it one day i said so you did get yourself again he said shit i'm told you i'm gonna be my own boss i'm gonna make this money worth for me and then i said have you seen have you seen uh uh what's we call it he like uh terry i said yeah he said man terry that dude is off the chain that boy moved to California. Man, he opened up one new spark, a uh, 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 business. Man, he don't deal with nothing but the rich white people, okay? I'm like, well, he said, man, he put that money to work. You hear me? He got a, a million dollar a, a business now. What the hell? I said, what? He said, hell yeah. I said, Marvin, you tell me I'm the only one that do shit with my money. He said, where you, where you been, Glenn? I said, man, I've been over at the dope house, man. Fucking around, man. He said, but now, I said, I don't clean myself up. I don't get ready to open me a rehab center, you know, for the help of all the people like me. And I'm going to go from there. You know, he said, that is so wonderful, Glenn. But I didn't know you went down that road. I, I said, yeah, man, I went totally, totally off the deep end dealing with this um, this divorce and everything it just took a toll on me but now my mind is clean you didn't tell nobody he said no i didn't i said did terry tell anybody he said no they didn't we got off clean we are oh, just behind us now we fit to move forward i said you having a kid he said i got one little girl i said oh that's so sweet you know yes and i said uh uh do terry have any 
and, and any kid, he said, no, Terry don't have no kid. You know, he just by himself. He said he's just going to focus on his business. And later on, he probably found him a wife. And said so he's still single, acting still, acting nerdy, you know. I said, oh, my goodness. He said, but shit, <laughs> the terrorist up there, man, he rolling with the big boy. You hear me? I said, please don't mention that word. <laughs> he said, why? I said, that's why I was. Do you want to get in out rolling with the big boy, though? Yes, so hold on for a second.